Tonight, we're taking you to Pueblo for breaking news. Tonight, a violent home invasion resulted in shots being fired. Police are on the scene. And that's where we find KRDO's Emily Allen with this breaking story. Mike, we just got an update on the two victims that were involved in the shooting. Now, detectives are working on this home behind me on High Street. What we just found out about the victims is that one of those victims did have significant injuries from the shooting. They are in surgery right now. There is a second victim that had minor injuries. As I mentioned, police are going in and out of this home behind me. We know that two men with masks walked into that home and they ended up shooting those victims and the two dogs. Now we're gonna make our way down the street where you can see that police have this street blocked off. This is uh, blocking off High Street from 29th Street to 28th Street. We're gonna roll on some video right now of this crime scene. We spoke to neighbors who have been standing on the street corners watching all of this as police investigate. They said that they heard the gun go off. Like, we just saw like a bunch of fire, like firecracker like noises. I'm like, okay, that's like normal, kind of. It's like maybe it might be gunshots, maybe it's firecrackers. We don't really know. At this point, police do not have a suspect description. They are working right now to try and figure out who these two men were that went into this home earlier tonight. If they get any more information overnight, we will continue to update you on the networks of CARDIO and tomorrow morning on Good Morning Colorado. And in the meantime, police said if you see anyone suspicious, even if it's as simple as seeing two men with masks, of course, they ask you to call Pueblo Police. In Pueblo, Emily Allen, CARDIO, News Channel 13.